hey guys welcome back to my channel it's susan here today we are going to be styling my teeny mini afro yes let's turn it into something looking nice and presentable So you need a spray bottle with water or any hair liquid you need a leave-in conditioner your hair gel and you need a white tooth comb a brush and a smaller comb Look, these are the avengers you also need a hair clip or a hair band depending on the length of your hair so first things first is to saturate your hair with water here i'm using my rosemary and clove water spray if your hair is freshly washed and damp you can skip this step but my hair is not washed at this point so i am going to saturate it with water as much as possible now i'm going to massage this into my scalp before going in with my leave-in conditioner i'll be using this leave-in conditioner and of course as a low porosity babe my hair will not hold water this is how much I've used this leave-in conditioner because I love it. My hair loves it. It does a really good job in keeping my hair moisturized and very soft. I'm applying it in this circular motion just so that it gets through my hair very well. And rubbing it like this will help my curls begin to form. This is how I'm going to be applying all of my products. The next stuff is my Eco Styling Gel. You guys know me and this gel. This is the only Eco Styling Gel that I like and I love. So I'm going to apply this also in circular motion. With this, my curls begin to form before I go in one by one or section by section to define it. You can actually do this, let it dry and go out like this and your hair is still going to be coily. But if you want that really defined, detailed, coiled look, then you can go in section by section to finger coil it. But personally, if you're in a hurry and you have somewhere to go, you can just apply it like this, rub it in circular motions just like this and let it air dry or use a blow dryer, which I don't recommend at this stage. Use a blow dryer and it will dry out and be beautiful. Now I'm going to go and section my hair from the back. I will use this clip to just put my hair away so that it's not getting in the way. Then I'll apply a little gel and go into section. I'm bringing you guys closer. Just pick a section and finger curl. That's all. Pick a sizable section. The smaller it is, the fuller the curls will be. The bigger it is, the bigger the curls will be. And guys, the smaller the curls, the longer it will last. It can last you for at least three to four days but the bigger the curls it won't last you more than two days because when you sleep even if you wear a bonnet is good there's going to be friction and the curls might just scatter because they are big but when the curls are in smaller section they will last you way way longer they can even last you up to five days if you maintain it properly but that's just it this is what i'm doing i just cut out the small section and finger curl just wrap it around my fingers that's all Also, you have to detangle each section before you go ahead to curl. I forgot to show you guys that part. But once you section a part, make sure you detangle it properly. Use a white tooth comb or a good comb and detangle before you go ahead to finger curl. This will help you have a smooth hair and your curl pattern will pop and be beautiful.
I think the part of making this hair that was really tedious for me was having to do the center, like the middle part of my hair, because both my hands had to be up. One was holding one part and one was curling the other. So it was really, really taxing. It's either I put my hand up at the same time or I bend my head to one corner just so that I'm not lifting my hands too much. But aside that, this hair is not so bad. You can actually do it yourself. It didn't take me up to an hour to get all these curls. Besides, my hair is short. It's not so long. It's if you are doing it on a longer hair, I think it will be a really, really taxing situation. But on the other thought, you can use a comb. Like, if you don't want something really, really defined, you can use a detangling brush, any detangling brush you have to do this. But if you want that finger curls effect, you have to use your fingers. Now this is the finished look guys i really liked it i went ahead to leave it to air dry yes air dry i did not use any heat i don't think i'll be using heat anytime soon on my hair this is it very beautiful i really am enjoying this my new look let me know in the comment section what you guys think about my look do you like this hair do you like this look on me and if you are on a short hair like me will you be trying this hairstyle let me know if you have tried it and what are your thoughts about it Personally, I love it and I think you can rock it to any occasion with any outfit. This new look is just bringing another side to Susan that I don't know, but I love it and I'm here for it. So guys, that's the end of this video, guys. Please leave a comment in the comment section. Tell me what you think and don't forget to like, comment, subscribe and I'll see you in my next one. Bye, guys.